are we today? We are going to be doing Assassin's Creed Syndicate part uh, part 20. Um, so, um, I just got in and people started attacking me, so I was like, um, okay, I'm gonna kill you bitches. Um, and then we've got our actual mission is just over here. It's just around this corner. It's just... Aha! There it is. Right. Driving Miss Disraeli. Oh, Marianne Disraeli wants to see the Devil's Acre and she requests the help of her new bodyguard, Jacob. Oh, okay. Then we might as well, um... Switch! They're gonna switch us anyway. There we go. Right. Play! Madam? Mr. Fry? Ready to take the air? Devil's Acre should just be coming alive. I'm afraid I must cancel our engagement. The lawn is crawling with scandal-hunting journalists, and I simply cannot be seen in the company of someone so... I'll see them off. You follow along when it's clear. Yes, yes. Uh, be gentle, won't you? The press are notoriously touchy about any violence to their person. Ha, 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 ha. I'll barely ruffle a hair on their heads. Shh, Desmond. Hmm. A dog's called Desmond. Use tools to distract the reporters. So, distract the reporters with the nearby paper girls. <clears throat> okay. So, these are the people that I need to distract. So, I need to find the nearby paper girls. Which is you? Yes, it is. <clears throat> right, okay then, so, uh, we need to escape the journalists, right, okay. So I went quiet there for a minute, I was getting really confused by all of this stuff. Right, we need to turn left here. Escort Mr. Israeli to the Devil's Acre, right, okay then. But anytime we see journalists, it basically like resets your progress. That's a bunch of bullshit, isn't it? Right, okay, so. If we. Oh, fantastic. 
I mean, they're not hard to shake off, but... Oh, we're getting close now, we're getting close. As long as I don't see another shitty carriage from the journalists, I'll be fine. Oh, that's a tree. That's a tree! Expertly done, Jacob. Nice maneuvers. <gasps> oh, God, she's just going for it. Okay. But if I move even the tiniest bit, she like falls behind. Look, she just fucking falls at me arm. Like there's walking slow. Oh god, what the fuck is that? Oh god. Well that's great and all that. What the fuck is going on? Uh, let's try this way. Oh my god, would you just fuck off, Desmond! You stupid motherfucker! Oh, I just want to silence that dog forever. Fucking little shitty dog. It's not even a nice dog. Oh, piss. Very industrious, I'm sure. Shall we go? Come on, you fat bitch, move faster. What happens if I just go faster? Oh, okay. Well. Oh, fuck me. Oh, shit. Right, let's go the long way around because there were two fucking. Couple of blotters over there! Because that's inconspicuous, you stupid bitch. Right, come on then. Uh, here's a strange one, isn't he? Mmm, yes, well, he's rather not normal, isn't he? Fuck off, I'll stab you in the neck, you bastards. You bloody bastards. Oh shit, there's a guy there. Oh, there's another guy there. Oh, okay, you you fucked off a bit, so I'm alright with that. I'm at eight with that, yeah, bastard. Fuck off. Probably cock meat is what you're selling. Actually, I don't know. He might be. I mean, it might be a bit expensive for him. Ah, dog. Wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. This is a punt, is it? Oh. Remarkable. The fuck? Oh, what is going on? Oh, 
Oh, can't just let the dog die. Can't we just let the dog die, really? I don't think we will. Yes, rather. Oh, come on, and you're not even a fucking... You're not even a challenge, lad! You're not even a fucking challenge! Just stop it, you know. You could have survived that. But instead of I had to just like slit your throat because you're a bell end. Well, don't say I didn't warn you. I didn't want to have to kill you, but I did. Okay. Stupid bastards. Yeah, drive. <laughs> I love that. Tell you what, the driving's brilliant on this game. Absolutely love it. I don't trust that woman. <clears throat> everything with that pearl at away and everything. You know, you think you find someone good who wants to help you, and then they turn out to just be Starrick's cousin or some shit like that. So. Right. I've got a fair bit of money for that. Right then. Oh. Motion to impeach. And is that the last one? Ooh, this might be our last mission for 
Sequence 7. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm sure as hell going to find out. Right, let's go. Let's go up. Up, up, and up. Oh, wow, it's not actually that high up. It's a medium height upwards. Hmm, right, okay. Oh, it was quite far away. Okay. I just drove through it, didn't I? Right. Okay. Don't even have to fucking wall climb anymore. Just fucking hit L1. And you're at the top of the building in no time. Which, I understand the feature, but... As an Assassin's Creed fan for a long time... That's one of the bits that I really enjoy, is climbing up a building and figuring out how to do it. You know... But, uh... Just being able to press L1 and get to the top of the building is a bit shit. But, I understand it. Anyway. Sequence 7. Motion to impeach. Jacob plans to assassinate the Earl of Cardigan within the Houses of Parliament. Play. Play. Let's do this shit. in opposition against this perfidious law. Very, very interesting, no? Okay, I... I've done the unique kill opportunity before, and I have to say, it was a bit boring, because... Well, no, I don't, I don't, I don't, this one seems boring, because it's just finding a password on, from the inside of someone's pocket. The corrupt policeman and the politician giving, like, an assistance, I think that sounds awesome, so... Don't kill any peace, uh, policeman and don't get killed by the target. Now, the last time I did one of these, it was... Or it's, well, it seemed fucking impossible... Now, don't kill any policemen and don't get detected by the target. Okay. So we need to get into the ground somehow. So that's the first thing that we'll focus on, is getting into the building. Okay. We're inside our perimeter now. Um, right. Here we go. Right. Right, so you... Uh, our so I need to kidnap him to do that one easy entry into parliament guards will move out of his way so I need to kidnap him out the way of everyone else and then I can potentially just walk all the way through Or if I go to him, he'll find the target 
and then I just have to follow this guy to Cardigan's office because he will help me. Oh, I'm not sure what to do. I quite like both of those. Right, but the problem with that one is I need to find an entry point. And obviously there's one underneath me, which is great. Oh, there's one over there. Okay, actually, yeah, let's check out the one over here first. And see if it's just like a... Just check if it's a... Uh... Ooh. Okay. Okay, so if I there we go, didn't want to have to do that, but you forced my hand, bitch. Right. Ooh. Ooh. Here we go. Oh, I like this. Oh, this is very sneaky. Very sneaky. Well, how else was I meant to deal with him? And now the politician won't move. Well, it looks like we're going to have to do this on our own. Right. Mate, mate, come on. Come on. Pal, no. Okay, mate. <laughs> We'll just leave you there then, shall we? Don't really know what else I was meant to do, but okay. Yeah, he's still cowering in fear. Great. Who are oh, you? are that fucker outside. Oh my god. Right. Oh my god. Okay, so you turn around. I just need Big Fatty over there to turn around. Okay, apparently that's that's a thing now. 
I can't reduce my distance to the target, you fucking tard. Ah, uh, so he's gonna spot me if he turns around, but that guy's gonna spot me anyway. Oh god. Oh Jesus. There we go, that'll do. Um. Um, I don't think this is going very well. Um. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. You really want to beat him, don't you, fella? There we go. Come on. Come on. There we go, fatty. Come on. There we go. Come on. Fucking die, dickhead. Fucking have it. Fuck off. Well. Brilliant. Okay. I love how you guys just don't even care. Brilliant. Okay. Okay. Um. Well, I suppose if we're here, we might as well uh, loot some bodies. Okay. Well, it was worth trying. Oh, come on, come on. Oh, my God. Jeez, look at that blood spray. Let's fucking kill the fucker. Come on. Come on. What the fuck is going on? Why is this a bunch of bullshit? I can't get up, but I can L1 my way up. Jesus Christ. In fact, fuck you guys, I'm just gonna kill you. I'm not, I'm just gonna stab this guy instead. That'll do. That'll do. Take your bow, knave, for you have managed 
what no Russian battery, what no Indian tiger could achieve. Claim your trophy, and may you choke on it. Yes, but do tell me more about Balaclava. Farewell. Farewell, dear Britannia. Your dawn shall be dimmer that the Earl of Cardigan sees it not. God save the Queen and the Eleventh Hussars. What a prick. I was thinking the same thing, Jacob. Absolute fucking delusional bell end. Right, let's just keep running. Right, escape the area, become anonymous. Fuck off! Fuck off, will ya? Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. Oh, finally. I literally just wanted to find a fucking carriage that was facing the right way. So I can just escape the fucking area. That'll do. There we go. There we go. Don't kill any policemen. Don't get detected by the target. Well, give fuck yourself. Because... I'm really either. I'm really bad at those. Oh, all is fair in politics. I've just got that. Uh, oh, that was sequence seven. A trophy for sequence. Does that mean I've finished sequence seven? Oh, I have. From the death squad on our tail, apart from that. Backup's on the way. Why are you pushing yourself so hard? It's not your job to fight Templars. I had this colleague. He was our boss's son. I didn't much care for him at the start. Everyone treated him like he was so bloody special. To me, he just wasn't invested in, in, in anything that didn't affect him personally. But I was wrong about him. He became my friend. Put himself through hell and he saved us all in the end so i reckon well i can't apologize to him but i can i don't know i can try and live up to his example you are a good assassin holy jeez hello it has been too long galena blimey i have not seen you since we blew up that lab in paris uh, there were many explosions and you screamed like a baby Bishop tells me Old Silbert was here. I will kill him for you. Super. Great news. Now, if you wouldn't mind keeping watch, I am going to lie down and die now. Rest. We have a big fight coming. Sean and Rebecca are safe for now, but we're still relying on you to find us that shroud. A letter for me? Well, there you have it, guys. We have done sequence one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and now we are going to be doing sequence eight, which means I reckon this uh, series has probably only got a couple episodes left in it now. But anyway, um, um, if you haven't watched the uh, if you haven't watched the Slime Rancher video, then first of all, go and check that shit out. Um, but second of all. Uh, this series, once this has finished and we have completely finished the main storyline, we will be doing Far Cry Primal uh, on the channel. I don't know whether we're going to be doing like a full let's play of it. Um, it's not going to be like a walkthrough anyway. It'll just be 
a uh, a let's play of the game, uh, as it were. Um, but let us know what you think in the comment section below. But anyway, I'm going to leave this episode here. So, thank you for tuning in and watching this episode of Assassin's Creed Syndicate. If you enjoyed watching it, then hit that like button and feel free to subscribe if you haven't already. You can follow us on Twitter by clicking the links in the description box below. Uh, but that's it from me here. So until next time, keep jiving! I